This is a training of some 40 South Sudan revenue officials in Kampala this week. They are taking lessons from the Uganda Revenue Authority on taming rampant smuggling and tax evasion. Hello. They are keen to learn how cargo tracking technology works. What measures are taken after realizing certain things like uh, accidents or infrastructure delays on the cargo? The enforcement of electronic cargo tracking notes represents a significant step forward in regional and cross-border trade by ensuring cargo is accurately documented and monitored from departure to arrival. And on the Ugandan side, the Commissioner Customs says the system will help enhance security, reduce fraud and promote efficiency. You take charge. If you are in charge anywhere, you take charge. Invesco is there to facilitate and make sure our work goes well. Please, let's support them and uh, you will see how revenue will increase. We used to collect 26 billion in Uganda, that's how many dollars we can exchange. But now we are doing 40 billion per day. That is a huge, huge growth. South Sudan officials in Kampala admit that they have realized revenue losses as a result of round tripping and under declaring. Because the world is advancing right now, and uh, South Sudan is also one of the countries that is advancing into that, we had to introduce the ECTN, that is the, the cargo tracking electronic devices, the notes. Uh, this device, it is end to end. It will help us, you know, to minimize on the rate of the what of the smuggling it will help us to minimize on the on the rate of the dumping and then uh, the other above all is that both the country they will realize they will breach in that gap of revenue what yeah revenue reductions is the facilitation of the trade between uh, the, the EAC community and that's South Sudan is within this community and the second thing uh, is to boost up the or to enhance the oil uh, the non-oil revenue collection and the third thing of course is to to reduce or to get rid of smuggling of goods heading to South Sudan. Experts' expectations are this knowledge will help revenue authorities on both ends by, among other things, aligning clearance processes for goods in transit and reduce delays, etc. And the systems we're going to provide you will be able to tell you and the responsible parties at any one point where a container is, where it has reached. You'll be able to pull the document for that cargo at any point to understand what should I be expecting in this container. South Sudan is one of Uganda's largest trading partners with receipts worth 389 million US dollars in 2021, according to Government of Uganda records. Malcolm Sime, NTV Weekend Edition.